Hi and welcome to the Packer TV Daily for Friday, December 24th. I'm Tamara Forlansky. Yesterday we had a very timely story on the Basket of Joy outreach program. You can watch that story in our video library. Today Dan Galbraith shares an opinion on what the administration's trade agreement signed with South Korea could mean. The upside of exporting is tremendous, particularly for fresh produce. It allows the domestic market to strengthen as it gets excess product out of the market. And in the big picture, it grows our economy with foreign dollars. So it's good to see the Obama administration finalize a trade agreement with South Korea in early December. It still must be approved by Congress and by Korean legislators, which is expected. The agreement would phase out many tariffs on fruit and vegetables headed to the nearly 50 million South Koreans. U.S. fresh fruit exports to South Korea totaled $122 million in 2009, and that would grow significantly once the deal is approved. Trade with other countries creates jobs, lowers deficits, and brings in foreign money. This is Dan Galbraith for the Packer Editorial Board. Thanks, Dan. Now, if you haven't had a chance to check out our feature story this week on Bolt House Farms legal action against Ecolab, you can click on the banner right below this video player to see it. Now, we're taking a holiday break and we'll return Monday, January 10th. So from all of us here at the Packer TV Daily, happy holidays to you, your family and friends. See you next year.